Hi, Adam Thomas, Osteopath, Osteopath Central Sports and Spinal Rehab DVD series. Uh, foam roller today is not for rolling. We're actually going to use it long ways. And you'll see my foam roller I've got for the video is ever so slightly short because I'm tall. From here, we get good neck control, good lumbar pelvic control. We're going to expand our shoulders out, relaxing. If you have a full length roller, your head would rest. And we're going to expand those shoulders up. This is getting from um, shoulder girdle opening. It's also a really good place, if you have the mobility, to let your head hang out. Trying to get your chin chucked, not tilting your head back. Chin in a little bit so the back of your head's on the table, your eyes are still looking towards the ceiling. As those shoulder blades drop over the foam roller, uh, your elbows down towards the floor. Feel free to take nice long slow breaths here to help open up that diaphragm and shoulder girdle that often closes down when you're a desk worker or a repetitive worker that works in front of yourself. If you are suffering a back injury, getting off it, just that little motion is often too much. So naturally you bring one hand over and you roll off just for safety. It's quite an advanced one uh, for spinal stuff. If it's just for your shoulder and your spine's fine, then that's a brilliant release. Just be careful, make sure osteopaths uh, indicated that you're fit and able to do it.